Yeah. What up, y'all? This your boy Ace here. Welcome to Afternoon's Delight. So, let's get down to it. So, uh, we got our next Abby Steiner film session. And uh, for this uh, fifth episode now, we're going to stick with high school. And we're going to go... A year four, we're going to go to Abby Steiner's junior year where she was 17 years old. We're going to go to the 2017 200 meter final. So we're going to do her first individual event uh, in this uh, film series on the high school level. So last time we did the relay race, if y'all want to go back and watch that video, y'all can definitely check that out on the channel. It's doing very well. It's got about over 5,000 views up to this point. Um, I think I released it maybe three or four days ago. So it's doing very well. Now, like I said, this is the first time we're going to break down an individual race. And the next video, next film series video or two, we'll go back to the relays uh, from the same exact year. I also wanted to do her 2016 individual. So we'll probably do that. And then we're going to kind of scurry on to maybe college after that. Uh, I want to do some college. Like, all of this is out of order. It's not really in order. Um... But we're definitely going to probably do like college and I'm probably going to do some indoor stuff. I, want, I definitely want to break down one of her indoor track races. So uh, on a college level. So that'll probably be first um, when we get into college and then we'll start doing her outdoor stuff. But uh, but yeah, man, uh, I, I've been very uh, impressed with this series as far as like your guys support on it. All the videos have performed well. Um, and I can't wait to get this one out to you guys. So let's get right to it. So, like I said, this is the 2017 Ohio State Division One Girls 200 Meter Dash Final. So, uh, Abby Steiner again representing Dublin Kaufman. Uh, Donisha Brewer from Withrow will be uh, one of the Withrow runners in here. Y'all know Withrow. Uh, has been the, the, the school in the relay races that Dublin Kaufman has been having to beat in order to win. So that's where they are. But uh, really, the girl that really comes the closest to Abby is this girl named Mackenzie Long. She's from Pick Central. So uh, let's let's um, let's get into it. So let's go ahead and without further ado, let's go ahead and play it. Like uh, in the beginning, I'll let y'all hear the audio on it. I've been I did that with the last video. I wanted y'all to get like a feel for the audience, and we'll play the audio again uh, right after I break this down for the first time. Then we're gonna you know replay it and see if we can see anything. Then we'll wrap it up from there. That's how we do it on this film series. So let's get started, y'all. Let's hit the well first before I set this up. Abby Steiner will be in uh, lane number four. And in her prelim before this, uh, I, I'm using this site called Finish, uh, Finish Timing. They've they've got some great breakdowns in here, man. Uh, salute to them for putting this through, setting this up. But her prelim was a 23.71. And that's just in a prelim? To be getting under 24 seconds as a 17-year-old, it's just... Freaking insane. Only someone like Abby Steiner can do that or some of the Jamaicans. Like, you just ain't going to find so many 200-meter runners running under a 24 flat. Like, you just ain't going to find too many. That's a, that's that's absolutely insane that she even got a 23.71 in the prelim. Let's see if she breaks it in here in the final. Because a lot of times, Abby turns on the jet in the final. So, now let's play. All right. So, remember, Abby is in lane four. She's on the top of your screen, sort of like near the top. You can see her in the middle right here. Lane number four. You see her trailing right now. Then she catches up. The girl that she was trailing at first, that was um the McKenzie Long girl. And look at that. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Did you guys see that? I mean, did you guys really see that? Let's, let's play it again. This time, you know what? I'm going to let y'all listen to the audio, then I'm going to cut back in. Let me let y'all listen to the audio. Hit play. Let's go, Madeline! Let's go, Madeline! Let's go, Just 
just absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Great work by the person who had the cameraman, uh, whoever was the cameraman, too. Great work by the cameraman. Uh, salute to the cameraman on this. Uh, this was this was phenomenal work by the cameraman. I can't say that enough. Um, I literally can't say that enough. The, the the cameraman was the real goat in here, uh, because they showed the entire field too. Like it was a really good close up of what you needed to see. Um, here in this 200 meters. So great job by the cameraman. The camera was steady too. Very good stuff, man. Very good stuff. Uh, let's go on ahead and play this again. So let's play it right now. What? Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Play it now. Okay, so Abby right here then come out of the then come out shooting like a rocket out of the out of the blocks again her reaction time has to improve as a pro but when you look at it her chase down speed she just loves chasing people down she had to chase down McK poor mckenzie here and it was a wrap it was a wrap and look at her look everyone else looked it kind of tired except abby like a lot of people were starting to give up Abby was still on full goal. Like, she could have went another 200 meters. That's why I said, I think this girl could do the 400 meters. It's it's absolutely insane how she just caught this girl playing in slow motion for you guys right now. Look at this. I mean, it is just absolutely amazing. When, like, when she made the turn here, Look at just how she gains her speed. That top end speed, that closing speed is just, you can't teach it, bro. You just, you can't teach it. Like, this one is amazing to me. Like, this whole race is amazing. It looks like a lot of her college races, too. Like, that same chase down ability. Just when you think she's out of, like, just when you think she's coming in second or third. It always looks like, like, I'm telling you, every time you watch an Abby Santa Ray, it looks like she's coming in second, third, or fourth. Like, it always looks that way. And then you get to that turn, and it's lights out. Like, going, like, 130 to about 150 meters into the race. It is a wrap from there. It is a complete wrap. Like, it is... It is amazing how Abby does that, man. Like, <laughs> Abby got some serious closing speed that you cannot teach. And this is this is the early Abby Steiner as well. This is the early Abby Steiner. So, it's amazing what we're seeing there. Let's go on ahead and look at her final score. 23.56. Oh, my God. 23.56 guys as a 17 year old remember she's a 17 year old getting this far under a 24 flat like she's no she's nowhere close to 24 seconds like she's at 23.50 she's at 23.50 <laughs> that means in another year when her legs get stronger she probably can run under a 23 flat right we'll see we're gonna do her 20 her, her senior season we're going to do her senior season 200 meter final. And if she's below a 23 in that one, as an 18 year old, oh my God. Oh my God. This girl is special, bro. You can see the rest of the times here. Nobody's even close. You got girls racing 25, bro. Like, like the norm in this age group is anywhere between 24.15 and, and I'll say probably like a 24.50. Like, that's what the norm is for anybody who's 17. To be running a 23.56. And remember, she had to come from behind on Mackenzie Long in the last 100 meters. I will say about the last 80 to 90 meters, she had to really gain that ground on Mackenzie. Just to beat her. And look at her times when the stuff finishes. Like, it was the same thing in the relay race that we saw in the last video. It's just... And then um, her nationals from this year against Tamara Clark. 
still distance on the second place runner. Like it's not even it's not even an at the line finish, like a, a close at the line finish. And I forgot to mention this too. Um Abby Steiner actually improved from 2016, but here was the jit. In 2016, she was already running under a 24 flat. Her score, her time was a 23.92 in the final. But in the prelim, it was a 23.75, bro. This girl was already running close to the score that she got in her junior year at 16. Are you kidding me? Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're going to talk more about that. We're going to talk more about that. We're going to talk more about that. Trust me. We're going to talk more about that. That is crazy. That is crazy. I forgot to mention that. That was the one thing. It's because my page wasn't on 2016 uh, when I was doing the video. Again, her final was 23.92, but her prelim was 23.75. And to compare it, her prelim in the junior year was 23.71. And then her final was 23.56. That is crazy that she was able to get under a 24 flat as a junior. That girl is fast, bro. <laughs> this girl is amazing, man. When you actually break this down. Let's look at this one more time, guys. Let's look at this. And then we're going to wrap this up. Let's look at this one more time. All right. Let's hit play. So Abby is in lane four again. He's in the middle. Look at this. So this is, the hundred, this is the first 50 meters. We're getting into the first 100 meters right here. They make the turn. Here we go. And they just on full throttle. He throttled her. He throttled her, bro. Come on now. Stop playing with me when it comes to Abby Steiner. Stop playing with me when it comes to Abby Steiner, bro. Stop playing with me, bro. This girl is amazing. Amazing. When was this on Friday, June the second, twenty seventeen? Man, this is man. She's something else, man. For real, for real. She's something else. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. I I, I don't I don't look. Y'all just hit the like button. <laughs> just hit the like button. Like I've watched this race probably about twenty times before I did this video, just so I knew what I was talking about. And, I, and I'm more amazed on the 20th time I've seen it in just the past 24 hours. Wow. Hit that like button for me. Hit that like button for me, y'all. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel, especially if you're new in the zoo. Any comments I got, definitely put them below. And if you want to donate to the channel, hit that super thanks button below. Shout out to my boy, David Close. He actually sent another dono last week, another $10 dono. That's two $10 donos on this channel. So he sent about 20 bucks to the channel. Y'all got to catch up to my boy, David Close. $20 sent to the channel through this date. And uh, salute to that man. And if you want to send a donation, you can send one either through the Super Thanks or the Cash App. My Cash App is on the screen right there. Dollar sign sack exchange. But y'all know I appreciate y'all. As long as y'all go ahead and watch, as long as y'all watch this video, y'all hit the like button. That's all I can ask for, man. Especially if y'all comment. All right. So, to wrap this up, man. Salute to Indian Sports Media. Uh, shout out to them. Uh, Indian just uh, surpassed the 1,000 subscribers. So, congratulations to him. Support him over there. He's got a great channel. He's doing like what I'm doing with the European athletes, giving them some more uh, exposure. And he broke down the Abby Steiner and Gina Lukenkemper uh, video, which is the best breakdown I've seen anybody do on YouTube when comparing two athletes. Like, it is the best. I I'm sorry to everybody else who made a video like that, but none of them top with Indian Sports Media did. I'm Trust me. Now, I watched that video twice already because of how good it was. Go over there, subscribe to that channel. Uh, definitely will leave a link in the description box, but definitely go check out that channel and subscribe, y'all. This was to me, because I, I I saw her 100 meter race from 2016. That's the one that, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm planning on breaking down. 
I haven't seen her. Uh, the only unfortunate thing, I haven't seen her 200 meters from 2016 yet. But as I'm watching this, like she breaks records. And the other thing that I did not point out, she actually broke a record here. Like she broke a record here. Yeah, she broke a record here. Someone named Arianne Payne. Had a 23.65 back in 2007, uh, 2007. So at this time, it was a 10-year-old record, and Abby Steiner obliviated a 10-year record. for This person was from Cleveland Heights, Beaumont. Absolute Ohio State legend, Abby Steiner. Okay, so this is what's next. So I think we're going to break down that 2016 100-meter dash. This is the one where she falls at the line. I think we're going to break that one down next. She was really, I, I've noticed a little change in her from 2017. She was really wild in 2016 in her sophomore year. She is a, She's running a little bit more discipline, but she's still wild a little bit, but she's a lot more disciplined in 2017. And that's going to come natural of age. But I can't wait to break that one down. Then we're going to break down the relay. And then we're going to get to her college stuff and take a little break from high school. There's still some more high school stuff we got to break down. Probably about three or four more races. Or I, I got to look at it, but then we'll finish up with high school. But uh, we're definitely going to get into our college stuff after that relay race in 2017. Then I'll go back to 2018 and finish all of that up. So that's how we're going to do that, guys. Thank you guys for watching. After News Delight. Salute y'all.